Hi. Um, so it's about 1 a.m. right now. Um, and I had a lot of thoughts on my head, like a lot. And I kind of just wanted to get them off my chest. So don't mind me. Don't mind my little video. I have wanted to do this. This career. Be a YouTuber since I was 7 years old. I've just wanted to make videos and edit videos and create videos and meet new people and make people laugh, make people happy for the longest time. I'm 20 years old now and I think it's about time for that drink to die. Like it gets to a point in time where you can't just, oh if I do this it, it will happen, if I do this it will happen, like no not gonna happen for me I'm a nine to five person that is my life um, I've been on this platform for five years I'm making videos for five years editing videos for five years actually I've been on there longer than that I've been on here since I was 13 I had a whole channel I had a few channels before this one uh, I got bullied for them, so I deleted them, I deleted all the videos. Some people found this channel and they bullied me for a while, so I privated all my videos, I like didn't upload, I didn't edit or anything for my whole high school career when I was like, literally the only thing on my head is I want to make videos. That's all I wanted to do. That's all I've ever wanted to do is just make videos. I want to make someone's day, I want to put a smile on someone's face just, just once. Just make somebody smile. I've done that. I've done that for a few people. I've done that for about four people <laughs> in my life. They smiled. They told me they liked my videos. They followed me on Instagram. I'm not saying I'm going to stop making videos. I'm going to still do this. I'm probably going to upload videos once a week. But at this point in time, I'm not hoping for anything, really. I don't expect anything anymore. I was... Not that I was expecting anything, but I was just, I was like, maybe I'd like do this edit or I try this song or I do this video or I try this trend or I do my hair this way or I put makeup on or I do this, I do that, I do this, I do that. Someone will see me. And a hundred of you did, so thank you for that. But five years and a hundred subscribers. I like see channels that have been around for like six months and they have 24.6 thousand subscribers. And like I'm never gonna get to that point. It sucks. It sucks that I'm realizing that now. It sucks that I'm letting my little seven year old self down. I let her down. Why are you crying? Stop it. And like it's no one's fault but mine. Like I was, I was never consistent. I always had another reason of why I couldn't do it. I mean, because of my anxiety, my depression, because I'm bipolar. I always had another reason. And when I get bipolar, when I have my ups and downs, when I have my manic states, um, I get so into YouTube. I get so into YouTube. I'm like, I'm gonna upload three times a day, or I'm gonna upload three, three videos a week. I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna have this new upload, I'm gonna have a new intro, I'm gonna create all these edits, I'm gonna download Photoshop, I'm gonna make all these things. And my manic state dies. And I don't upload one day. And I give up with myself. You didn't upload, you're a failure, you suck at this, you'll never be good. No one's ever gonna like you, no one's ever gonna watch you, no one likes you. Da -da -da, yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> right now, I'm coming down from manic state. That's what this was. It was me planning out all of September, all these videos that I wanna do. I wanted to go on TikTok. I wanted to post, like, I'm gonna post on TikTok six times a day. I'm gonna make a fashion TikTok because I'm really getting into fashion make a fashion TikTok. I'm gonna do all of this. I'm gonna make all these cool TikToks and 
I'm gonna become TikTok famous. And now I'm like, no one's gonna watch you. No one's gonna like your videos. No one cares. So now I'm here. And I don't think I've ever shown you guys the side of me. I don't really show anyone the side of me. Cause being sad isn't fun. Being sad isn't cool, but like, hey, this is me. A anxiety filled, depressed, bipolar little bean. A bipolar little bean who just spent probably like $300 online shopping to cure her sadness when she doesn't have a job and she needed that money, but she spent it on clothes that will barely be worn. I just wanted to, I guess, get that off my chest, cause, I don't know. I always see like these videos of these girls like, oh, I've been on YouTube for a year and I have 700,000 subscribers. And I'm not dissing them, like I'm proud of them. I'm so proud of all the girls who make YouTube channels. They have such a huge following in such a short amount of time. And it shows with their editing, it shows with their consistency, it just, it shows. It also sucks. Because I see people who are inconsistent like me, but they still have thousands of followers. So, I've come to the realization that it's not the videos that I'm posting, it's not anything like that, it's just that it's not for me. It's not my... Oh, so I'm, I'm not a social media person. I am a nine to five person. That's gonna be me. Probably gonna get this job, hopefully at Amazon, and work there the rest of my life. I'll make good money. You know, I've also realized that I'm not even a cool person in public either like every time there's like a manager position like no one looks at me for that because i'm the i'm an odd bean i i admit that i'm not like a normal kid i act weird i say weird things and i'm just kind of all over the place all the time because that's just how my head is i'm scattered 24 7 like this does not function like at all um the people only ever see me as like the funny, peppy, jolly person. And I'm like, Ugh. I hope you all know that that's not me. That's just the me that I put on for a show because I think that's what people want to see from me. They don't want to see this side from me. They don't want to see Sajimari. Sajimari is not fun. Sajimari doesn't make you laugh. Sad Jemari doesn't make you feel confident. Sad Jemari doesn't make you feel good about yourself. Happy Jemari compliments you 24-7. Happy Jemari makes you feel like a goddess. Or a god. I do it for other people's fun, not for mine. Because when I come home, I feel so drained. I feel so drained from just pretending to be somebody else. And it sucks. And I'm tired. So I'm done. I'm not put here for other people's amusement. I'm supposed to be here for me. So I'm I'm making videos for me now. I'm not gonna try and be like other big creators that I see and try and like emulate them in my videos because that's what people watch. That's what I see people watch but like they don't watch me. I get probably ten views of video and it hasn't gone up. I get a few viral videos. I have the eating, what I eat in a day with the factor 75. And then I have the meet my corgi because it's obviously a puppy. People want to see a puppy. I don't know. I don't know what this was. It's kind of me getting some stuff off my chest. It's been just dragging me down for a long time. But yeah. 
I'm done trying. Trying's never gotten me anywhere, so, you know. I've noticed that nothing in my life, nothing, ever goes my way. I don't think one thing ever happened for me has gone my way. Thinking about all the things right now that I planned in my life and then I like saved for, I budgeted for, I worked for, and then it didn't happen. I don't care. Anyways, I'm probably gonna make this into a vlog so you guys aren't sad when you start watching this video. Uh, so I'll see you in the morning. Well, later on today.